Hi, this is Melissa with Will Hoy Training. Thank you for joining me for Prospects in OneSite. Now I'd like to show you the Prospects page in OneSite. I'll start by adding a new prospect. To do this, I need to go to the top left and select New Prospect. This will open up a coached guest card where I can enter the new prospect's information. Any of the areas highlighted in red are required fields. I will select the drop down and select the method of contact. There's also the date, the time, and the consultant, which will default to the current date, time, and consultant, but you can change that if necessary. Next, you need to add what type of apartment they are looking for. You can add additional details, for instance, what level if they're looking for only a top floor or a specific floor plan. Next, we'll enter their name. Gender and how they heard about us. This is important for our marketing information. In this example, it was a resident referral. So I will click on the blue hyperlink that says resident referral to link this prospect to the current resident that referred them. Next, we need to enter when they expect to move. I'll click on the calendar and select the date. What is your reason for moving? How many people will be in the apartment? Do you have any pets? Do you have a price range in mind? If you set a future appointment, you could enter it at the top right next to appointment date and time. We'll also need some follow-up contact information. So I will enter in the phone number. And if I had the address, I would enter it here. There's also a spot for an additional phone number. Or email address if you're able to obtain that. At the bottom right, you can select save slash add contact if there's an, ad an additional contact for this prospect record. In this case, there's only one, so we'll just select save. One side is saving the information on our prospects page and has opened up this prospects at a glance page. I'll close out of it for now, but we'll go back to it later. Next, I'd like to show you how to get to the main prospects page in one site. I'll go to the top left, the navigation menu, which are the three bars, and then select prospects. In order to find the prospect that was just entered, I can type in their full or part of their name. And that pulls up the prospect that was just entered. I could also look for that prospect or any others by using the drop down on the right and selecting by status, my view by status. So I'll select all active so we can see all of the active prospects that we have housed on this page. Next, I'd like to show you how to print this page. So if we look at the print button. We can click there and the print list of all active prospects pop up in a PDF format. I'll go ahead and close out of that because I also want to show you that we can sort these columns. In this case I'll sort by needed by so that we have the prospects arranged in the need by order. Now if I go back to print the list will be also sorted in that order. 
if I want to go back to a prospects at a glance page, I would find my prospect and select view to the left of their name. I can edit or add information here. And the next step would be to uh, apply now in the actions column on the left once they have submitted an application with security deposit and application fee. That's it for now on Prospects page. Thanks for listening.